Happy Halloween! My name is Hannah and I'm a zookeeper here at the Santa Fe College Teaching Zoo. Now when you think of fall, you probably think of Halloween, pumpkin patches, apple picking, and corn mazes. Well, we thought that our three banded armadillos could use a little fall fun. So we've set up a corn maze just for them. To make this, we just used cardboard and corn stalks. Pretty easy. Armadillos have a great sense of smell which will help them get through this maze. I've placed a few of their favorite treats at one end of the maze for them to sniff out. Armadillos are pretty cool mammals. They're actually the last living mammal to have a shell. The three banded armadillos, like Dylan and Virginia, are the only ones that can roll completely into a ball, which protects them from predators. Their shell, which is made of bony plates covered by thick, hard skin, is tough for most threats to get through. And armadillo even means little armored one in Spanish. They also have these really long nails on their front feet that they walk on and use to dig. Three banded armadillos aren't as good at digging as the nine banded armadillos, which we see right here in Florida. Armadillos are great at helping control pets, especially insects like fire ants. One of their favorite snacks is a super worm, which is like Halloween candy to them. So they only get it as a special treat. They also love mealworms, which they get regularly. The best way to wake Virginia up is to place a mealworm under her nose so she can sniff it and she'll perk right up. Dylan also loves grapes and bananas, but Virginia likes to stick with the worms. Dylan and Virginia were placed together after a recommendation from their species survival plan in hopes that they'll breed. They've been together since June and had a connection right away. Dylan is very outgoing. He loves to run around his habitat and check out enrichment. But Virginia is kind of quiet and can be shy around people. Since being with Dylan, she seems to have opened up a bit and is more comfortable around us, which we love to see. Did you know that mazes date back over 4,000 years? And the word maze comes from a Middle English word, meaning delusion or delirium, which can certainly be the feeling you get in some mazes. A good rule to follow when you're in a maze is to place your right hand on the wall and keep it there. You'll eventually find your way to the exit without getting lost. Dare to care and donate non-perishable food throughout October to the Ghost, Goblins, and Groceries Food Drive. All donations will support Saints Food Chair and Catholic Charities Food Pantries. You can even get discounts on your zoo admission for donating. More information can be found on our Facebook or website at sfcollege.edu slash zoo. Happy Halloween and good luck on your adventures this season.